So there's this guy called Jeff Younger. You might not know his name, but you probably heard his story before. He's the guy who stuck his dick in crazy and unfortunately had some kids with her. Twins, in fact, a boy and a girl, and they're nine years old now. And because his ex-wife is insane and likes fashionable toys, she decided to turn the son into a trans girl at the age of three years old. Now, I'd just like to say I don't care about trans people. If that's what you feel is going to make your life better, go for it. Why would I care? Whatever makes you happy and all that. Dominate women's sports while you're at it. I think that's hilarious, personally. But a three-year-old cannot possibly make that choice to permanently change the path of their lives. I thought it was a car for a week when I was three. My mother didn't cut off my hands and feet and attach wheels. She understood I was an idiot three-year-old and let me move on to the next thing. So this is entirely down to the mother's encouragement and manipulation. It's not even up for debate. Children are really fucking stupid. They can't make choices like that. They lack the brain functionality. So Jeff, realising that his wife is batshit nuts, obviously opposed this child abuse and took it to court, where over a series of the most stupid legal decisions ever seen, he lost custody of his son and the mother now has free reign to use her fashion project to impress her friends. This spurred Jeff on to run for office to do something about this blatant child abuse and this brings us up to the day where he was speaking at an event at North Texas University and of course that was infiltrated by, yes, you guessed it, indoctrinated NPCs from the left who have been commanded to be outraged. You know, the normal stuff. They start off the event in a very sane and normal and mature way. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but one of the leading parts of fascism is forcibly suppressing opposition and criticism of what you are doing. So as usual, these weirdos are just projecting what they are doing onto others. But I don't want to be too serious, I mainly made this video to show you this clip because it just exemplifies the left nowadays so very, very perfectly. So let's see it. Well, she seems normal, doesn't she? This is a tolerant and rational left, ladies and gentlemen. And to be honest, I don't even care what the other person is saying. I'm automatically on their side. There's no way someone saying could possibly think anyone who behaves like that could ever be right about anything. And just think, if she had spent the same amount of time that she did being told what to be outraged about and went for a run or to the gym, she wouldn't be the size of a house and might have a boyfriend and be happy. And on the bright side, we know for a fact she won't ever reproduce. And boys, I think we may have found a new replacement meme for the new left this Trump meme. So yeah, universities are turning people into real weirdos, it seems. That's it for today's video. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe to see more content like this. Thanks, boy.